Well, Kenny Kai pushed the door open. It's partially open already. So I've got to eat my lunch and look after her at the same time. Can I do that? More cayenne pepper on the beans. Go inside for the sunglasses. The sun goes away. Boy, I can't even eat with my left hand. Ah, oh, Keeney. Mm-hmm. Skinny. Skinny, come back here. Skinny. Kai. Kuka knows. Kakai. Nope. Kakai. Kakai. That's my girl. Go on, Kakai. Go, baby. Okay, I'm going to carry you. Wow. That was nice. Puka cares more about you than food. That's a very good sign for a very sweet, chelty boy. Pookie, that yeah. deserves a kidney bean. That deserves a kid. <laughs> Goodness, it's for me. Ooh. Ooh, cayenne pepper. Why does she do that? Hookah. Cookie. Okay. Mmm. I should have taken a big spoon if I knew I was eating with you hooligans. I'm losing more than I'm eating. If anyone wants to know why organic, especially with beans. Beans are a remarkably healthy food. There's a dragonfly up here you might like. Oh. The most important thing in beans, besides the remarkable <clears throat> fiber that's in all food that's meant for humans, very high in trace minerals. And trace minerals are necessary at the very smallest levels of biochemical change that occurs in the body. So every cell in the body needs these trace minerals in teeny, 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 tiny amounts. But if you don't have them, you become diseased. You're partial to, to all kinds of sickness. When you grow them with pesticides, they're grown very quickly. They don't have a chance to, to reach deep into the ground and get and develop the, uh, the trace minerals. So that's why you should always eat organic. Um, ideally, make it yourself. This to me is my fast food. I needed a lunch. I just don't feel like cooking, and it's amazing the the carbohydrates um, help me with my any sugar cravings I might have or low blood sugar, which I don't, but if I had it, and it makes you feel full. It keeps your blood sugar level for hours and hours. Oh, and on a delicate nature, if there are unmentionable reasons that you don't want to eat beans, know that. After you eat them for a little while, that problem goes away. There's a specific enzyme called uh, galactase that is used to uh, break down the sugars that cause uh, beans to ferment. And your body only produces it when it needs to. So the first time you eat beans after not eating them for weeks or months, your body doesn't have it in reserve and you have gas. Uh, when you start eating it on a regular basis, even just a small amount, just a spoon, spoonful for a week or two, you're going to start building up a reserve and you won't have a problem. My uh, ancestors were Eastern European and I remember my mother telling me that my family had a hard time with me getting becoming vegetarian. She said that when she was a child in northern Croatia 
they would make a huge pot of bean and, and I guess root vegetable stew. Put a tiny sliver of smoked pork in there for flavor, not for protein. They, they got the protein from the beans. And that's what the, the men would and the women would eat. And these are people who worked really hard on their land. It really is the perfect food for humans as well as fruits and veggies and, and some grains. Here I am babbling and I want to eat my beans. <laughs> what? I guess Kinikai has declared this a day outside for all day long, and I concur. <laughs> 